Thankfulness is the rarest of flowers in the garden of virtues. Of all the ways that we can be virtuous, being grateful stands out because it blooms with the radiance of faith, hope, and love. Thankfulness is an act of faith because through it, we recognize that the greatest gifts in life do not come from our own effort. Do we thank ourselves for the air we breathe, for the sunset, or for our health? Do we pat ourselves on the back when a new day dawns and the rising sun brings new opportunity? Of course not. We are thankful for these moments because we know that they come from God, who invites us to share in them. Thankfulness is an act of hope because it places our fulfillment in something other than ourselves. We understand that we are not the ultimate answer to the deepest longings of our souls. As the book of Isaiah says, Surely God is my salvation. I will trust and not be afraid. Being thankful, grateful, or appreciative of others or of situations is a shimmer of hope, a small glimpse of God's saving presence that we will one day know in full. Finally, thankfulness is an act of love because recognition, be it of God or of others, is unselfish. There are few things more genuine than thanking someone without expecting to be thanked in return. A true tip of the hat goes unnoticed by everyone but you and the person you are acknowledging. And so, Thanksgiving is selfless, just as God's love is selfless. This Thanksgiving Day, let's start small by being thankful for having food to eat, a roof over our head, and a loved one to hold close. Thankfulness for the simple things in life is what brings us to bloom as a beautiful example of faith, hope, and love. Eventually, our hearts will sing aloud with Psalm 100, enter his gates with thanksgiving, his courts with praise, give thanks to him, bless his name. <laughs>